So when it comes to the weapon choice and gun, really anything that shoots 762 by 51 or 762 by 54, the SVD is a great choice. The M1A, SR25, the MK17, you know, anything that shoots M80s, even BCP, FMJ, these are all going to one-tab Sturman in the head, and they have pretty good penetration. You know, SNB and LPS, those are also really good ammos. Now, anything in the 7.62x54 category will one-tap Sturman in the head. He has a total of 62 head HP, as well as 7.62x51. Uh, Any of those bullets will also one-tap him in the head. So, you can even use Ultra Nosler if you don't have access to BCP or whatever. But I'm pretty sure you get that at, like, level 2 traders. So, BCP, M80, M61, M62, those are all going to be fine for him i don't rec recommend using like bp or ps because those will not one tap him in the head you'll have to two tap him which you know shouldn't be a problem anyways but recommend using m1a svd sr25 you know really whatever gun you want just try to use these two calibers okay so when it comes to farming sturman there's three locations on the map uh, that I really kill him from. Number one being this tin building. Number two being this rock here. So right next to the violet cabin down there. This rock is pretty special. You know, it's got like a little walk up. You can walk up and then check out where they are. Do a little smooth lean. Whatever you gotta do. And then number three, uh, that rock. So this is like the last resort going over there. But whenever I get here... Usually try to like bait some shots, peek up and down, see if he'll pop his SVD off. Because with Sturman's new AI, once he start, once he sees you, uh, his and his guards see you, they're just gonna push you like crazy. It's like one guard's gonna run up here, the other guard's gonna run up on this direction. Uh, you can also like run out here, try to aggro them, you know, run back, or even come to this rock and like you know really get them to aggro. But most of the times where I'm seeing Sturman here, I'm seeing Sturman behind this log pile right here. In front of these log piles or behind this log pile. You know, I've also seen him in between here. Um, in between these log piles as well as I've seen him a couple times like over in this general area. I know the guards like to roam over here. But yeah, whenever you first run up to the... A woods camp, the lumber mill, whatever you want to call it. I just like get a little angle here and try to bait some SVD shots. He'll probably be, be lurking like behind this log pile if you don't see him. He he can also go like in this wooded area, so just just be careful of that. But yeah, try to get his aggro, and then one guard's gonna push up. You know, around here he'll push up, easy kill, and then the other guard will push up. They're not they're never gonna come behind this rock that I've I've found, so you're you're like safe back here. But if you don't see him and he's not pushing you, you know, while you're there, I uh, will run up here. Try to try to stay behind cover. Quite a few things you can hide behind. And then I get to this rock. So this this rock's really good to kill him from as well. Just be careful. Uh, the guards and Sturman will run up like right here. Sometimes they'll even come, like, right here. But I try to, like, slow peek it. You know, sometimes I've seen him right here, right here. Just slow peek it, real slow. Scanning. And then, um, by then, you know, he'll definitely aggro. He'll run, he'll be running around. So this is, like, the last resort. If you're at that rock and you just can't, can't seem to kill him yet. Maybe you've killed one guard. Uh, then I'll run up here. So yeah, if you spawn in the scav house, I run up here usually. Uh, duffel bag hill, sniper hill, whatever you want to call it. And then I'll try to get a little peek, see if I can't knock his head off real quick. Um, and if I can't see him, I will run this way. Try not to get shot, you know. <laughs> Easier said than done, but... Run up here. And then get into the tin building. Now the tin building is really good to kill him from. 
show you a couple angles here just be mindful the guards do come like they do come up here sometimes they'll they'll come right here i've never seen them go in this door but you know just be careful they might be on that hill while you're sitting here but i just try to like peek get them to aggro sometimes he'll come in this front door or sometimes he'll come on this side area you can also sit right here you know this is a lot less risky you're not gonna get shot from behind on that door then you can see him if he's around here. You can aggro him. Really, that's all it is, just aggroing Sturman. With his new AI, he just pushes you like crazy. So, it's really easy to kill him. Most of the time, I kill him while he's running. He's not even shooting at me. A couple couple different spots you can come up here. This one's really risky. Uh, players and, you know, the guards can go out there. But yeah, just try to like play around in here. This is not like the most ideal place to kill him. I'd rather be up at that rock. But, you know, you, you can see them through this pallet and they won't be able to see you. So you can just like shoot them through the pallet. Ooh, that might be Sturman. They just killed somebody. Fuck, dude, I can't find his body. There it is. Must take hot dog bag. Run.
Yep, that's one of the guards. Now we just gotta find the boss. And he's probably right there. I'm dead. GG's. Yo, GG, Daniel. Sorry about that. Your laser, your laser gave you away. Alright, we killed him, we killed him, nice. Is that our boy? 